everyone, welcome back to Energeny TV. It's Jenny here, long time no see. Now today we will be talking about perhaps the most exciting topic of the season, the Olympics. Yay! <laughs> All right, let's get started. have athletes from all over the world coming to compete and celebrate their accomplishments at the Olympics. But I am rooting for a very specific team, and that team is... Refugee Olympic Team. Now, at first, I didn't even know there was a team called the Refugee Olympic Team until I read an article. And as soon as I read the article, I thought, wow, I really want to share this topic with my Energeny TV viewers. So here I am. The Refugee Olympic team was first created in 2016 by the International Olympic Committee. They decided that refugees who were forced to flee from their original country should still be able to compete in the Olympics. So a total of 10 refugee athletes competed in the Rio Olympics 20, in 2016. What is exciting is that the number of refugee athletes in this team grew this year for the Tokyo Olympics to 20 nothing. So according to my research, the number um, increased, as I said, 29 athletes from 11 different countries competing in 12 sports. So very, very impressive. So now I wanna introduce a website or a resource for you guys to look at. Um, I'm gonna be looking at my computer, but hopefully you guys will be able to see it um, in the background. So here is the Olympics website, especially for the Refugee Olympic team, Tokyo 2020. Uh, you can you scroll down, you see the flag bearers here, and uh, just, uh, a, a, I think it's a picture from the parade um, in the opening ceremony. You scroll down, it's just a brief description about the Refugee Olympic team. Um, I think we should take a look at this video, very short. Um, Like every elite athlete, we strive to be the best in the world. Our stories, our journeys are all very different, but we share the same dream, the Olympic dream. You'll see us competing with the same determination. You'll witness our courage, our strength, and the power of hope. Um, one thing that I did want to mention is if you click on the Meet the IOC Refugee Olympic Team down below, you can actually see uh, the 29 athletes that are competing in the Olympics. And you can even click on one of these profile pictures and get a more uh, specific description of their, their stories and their journeys. Um, and also which sport they're competing in. So I, I clicked on, and please excuse my pronunciation once again, Yushra Mardini. And she's a swimmer um, from Syria. And she also competed um, at Rio as well. And so we can take the time to read her biography here. One thing that I do wanna mention about Mardini is is and her story is that it really captures the essence of the refugee olympic team she talks about living in syria you know it's like you're living but there is no further goal in life but being able to escape and you know participate in these international games she's able to really show her determination for her future 
and really show the world essentially the power of hope and the power of determination and how these athletes are really achieving their dreams and goals. And so the Refugee Olympic team is truly an inspiration for the international community. They show us their tremendous courage and tenacity for life, their future, and we also see their unstoppable journey uh, towards their dreams and aspirations. So I will continue rooting for the Refugee Olympic team and I hope you'll join me. Thank you for watching.